Hi folks, Matt Edwards here on Friday with Vought RV, and today we're going to highlight a 2021 Jayco Octane 277, okay? It's a bumper pull toy hauler, fiberglass body, it is weight of 7520, so a heavy half or a three quarter ton can pull this real easy, okay? Has a hitch weight of about 1240, and has a cargo of 3400 pounds, that's a lot, okay? So we're going to start over here on this side. We've got an outdoor kitchen over here, which is really kind of cool. All wood. Place up here to put your spatula, stuff like that. Little refrigerator for your beer, or water. Nicely convenient. Also has the J-Port over here, which Jayco's putting in all their units now. Okay. We've got a storage rack here that's a pretty good size. I don't know if Brian can get in there, but look how tall it is. I mean, I think you could put chairs in there, uh, all kinds of hunting stuff if you wanted to, fishing poles, stuff like that. We are equipped with backup cameras as well as side cameras, okay? They're wired for it, actually. They're wired for it, okay? On the front up here, on Vought, we will always put you a fresh, brand new battery up here. We'll fill up both of your propane tanks. And again, that's no extra fees. We don't have any fees over here at Vought. Whatever you pay, plus tax tie license is what you pay. This also has the tongue, electric tongue jack, okay? Makes it real nice. Got your diamond plate up here on the front. Got your docking lights. They put a really nice little deal right here for your sewer hose, okay? It's kind of away from there, but it's, you know, it helps out a lot. We've got our four stabilizers down here, okay? They're not actually levelers now, these are stabilizers. That keeps the wobble out of it, okay? We've got a bedroom slide on this one. Let's see. There's our generator prep, okay? So she is wired for a generator, so you can add one real easy. A 5500 is probably what you'd want to put, or maybe a 45. Black, gray, black and gray tanks right down here easy to get to. Got our hot water heater, back of our refrigerator, and we are a 50 amp trailer in here, okay? So there's two ACs in here. Got our cable hookup right there, black tank flush, fresh water intake, city water connection, and then it has a fueling station for the generator, okay? Here is where your uh, uh, gas nozzle, stuff like that is, as well as your other cranks right here, crank down. And this is an emergency shutoff switch, okay? So you've got a, a fuel pump in there pumping the fuel out to your toys, but you've got a switch right here, you can shut that off if you need to, okay? The ladder's on the side over here, and what it does, you pull these pins out and it pops up, which give you access to the roof up there, okay? Now I went ahead and set out the patio on this one so everybody could see it. Okay. It's real easy to do. There's even a, a, a step that goes right here that's real secure that you can go up on. Okay. Now up along the top up there, you'll see all your, your lights up there, your place for your camera if you decide to add cameras on there. And I put the two bunks in the middle position down there. Okay. There's your dinette down there. There is a table inside that goes with it so that way you can sit at the table or you can move the table out here, put some chairs out here, okay? Then you've got your top bunk up there. So four adults can sleep really well in that one, okay? And again, like Brian was asking me, you take this cable off here and the cable off there and that brings your, your ramp down, okay? Then you're able to pull your bike or toys up there, okay? These are the vents inside that you open up on either side that help pull the fumes out when you have your bike or your toy in there, okay? Stabilizer jack. You've got a spare tire way underneath there and a crank right here that cranks it down. Now, if you'll notice, look how high this trailer sits up. You could take this out on some gnarly roads out there, I think. Now, you also have the Goodyear 16 inch American made tires, okay? Plus, all Jayco's have galvanized steel up in the wheel wells. So that way, if you do have a, th a tire separate, it's not going to beat the crap out of your trailer, okay? The entertainment side's really nice, really big. It's got the big awning out here. It's got the speakers in the arms right there. The 277 with the Moride steps. So let's go inside. 
Okay, welcome inside. This is your patio out here. We went ahead and raised the beds up so you could see. Now the distance between here and the back wall over there is uh, 15 foot, okay? The width between the kitchen countertop and the wall over there is 6.5. So you could probably park, you know, a really nice dress Harley up here, a small side-by-side, -side, a razor. Um, do have the tie downs that go all the way back over here. I've seen him put, you know, four or five dirt bikes in one of these before. So you've got plenty of room to do it, you know, the small stuff. Now these two come with the, with the European style recliners, okay? These are really nice chairs, you know? <coughs> now, up on the top bunk up there, there is a fold out table that comes down here, okay? So if you've got some bikes or something over the side over here, you can put your chairs over here and put your table out and you and your wife can still have dinner, okay? We've got the uh, double sink over here. We are equipped with solar panels and I'll show you that here in a minute. Like all Jayco's, all screwed and glued, no staples, okay? Plus, which I really dig, here's the keys. Two keys to go to everything, okay? Two sets. This also has your tire pressure monitoring system, your remotes. Jake, everybody asks about these, but Jayco sends these, and what they are is their covers that they make in their factory to cover the trailers, chairs up during transportation. So when you see those in there, they don't match. That's what they're for, actually, okay? Kind of cool. All righty. We've got our microwave. Also on this trailer is the Apex GPS tracker that can always tell you wherever your trailer is anywhere in the United States, okay? We've got an oven down here and a three burner stove, the Furion, okay? We've got our light. We've got our fan right over here. We've got our dual refrigerator, okay? That way it runs off propane and electricity. Look at that, Brian's already getting cold in there. They, they cool down fast. We've got some nice sized pantries over here, good size. Isn't that cool? All righty, now let's go down here to the master bath, okay? Now the bathroom has two doors, a door inside and a door to the bedroom too. So that way if a couple guys are out camping or they're, they're hunting, they, you know, they can each have their own private bathroom or go to the bathroom, okay? Now also, I'm a pretty big old boy and this is a nice big shower right here, okay? So I've got plenty of room in here. I can do the military shower. Plus I've got a porcelain commode. I really like porcelain commodes and Jayco's. When you clean them up, they're shiny, they're clean, you know they're clean, okay? We've got, a, we've got a nice vanity right here, along with a medicine cabinet right up here. Okay, we've got our lights up in here. Spam call. And we've got our fan for taco night, okay? That's a joke for my family when we used to go camping a lot. If mama made tacos, that means that, you know, things trailer kind of stunk sometimes. Now here's what I think is really cool about this. This is the master bedroom. It has its own 13.5 air conditioning unit up here, along with a heat pump in it, okay? We've got a queen size bed, and it looks like it's the full queen too, not a short queen, okay? They put up places to hold your water, your phone, a little bit of storage, plus the big thing about here is, you know, if you're gonna sit up in bed, I'm not bumping my head over here, okay? I got plenty of room through here. Now check this out. This is huge over here. Look at all these drawers. Look at all the storage in here. Up there you put your suitcase, unlock, pack your bags, put your rifles up there if you're hunting or your toys. You've got a little bit of a, a lip up there, you know, put stuff on. Then you've got these down here. Lots of storage, okay? Now check this out, right across from the bed is another big dresser, again with big drawers. And your clothes, your clothes, hanging clothes. Now up here is where you would mount your TV set. Looks like you get maybe a 32 inch or bigger in here, okay? Here's your solar panels. 
there are 190 watt solar panels up there. So what these do, these charge the batteries, which charges the refrigerator, on electricity, does all your lights. You can run solar and do everything except for your microwave and your air conditioner because they pull too much power. These are really cool and I think they're the wave of the future. You know what? Alrighty. I've tried my best not to say okay, so I'm working on it. But thank you all again for watching the videos. If you all have any questions, uh, please put them down in the comments. I try my best to get back to them to answer you. Uh, please hit subscribe. We're really working hard to hit that 10,000 mark. But y'all have a blessed day. Be safe out there. Thanks for watching our video. If you have any questions, be sure to drop a comment below. Or if you have any suggestions on content you'd like to see, we'd love to hear about that. Go ahead and give us a like and subscribe to our channel. Thanks again from Vod RV.